whatever I'm photographing, what I care about the most is telling stories and transmitting emotions. Doing like that street photography is a way of telling stories like of real life. You can stop in New York at any corner on the street and a minute later, a million stories will pass you by. I came from a journalist background. I had like experience in TV and radio and writing and a little bit all of it. And then I also studied like film directing for two years and did some documentary work and fiction work. My process would be like at night I would sit in the computer and decide, okay, like look at the photos that I have and and think like what what story can I tell with this written? And I would write like fiction stories or essays, opinion. But then sometimes I was like, if I had like one good image, I was like what if I tried to like get more serious in the photography? But I always thought, no, I'm, I'm not good at that. I am a big, big, big supporter and fan of uh, mobile photography. I like the aesthetic. I like the functioning, shooting with a phone, allows you that extra level of invisibility. If I'm like this in front of someone and just like tapping on their face like that, it's obvious that I'm taking a portrait. I just put the phone here on my hands, like sticking out, the lens is sticking out towards the left. What I can do is, you know, like I can pre-focus, lock the exposure, and then when I have like my frame, I just release the finger like this. Everyone's photos tend to start looking the same a little bit. So mobile-wise now, I tend to get inspired by people who do like maybe different things. And perhaps not as much aesthetically as, you know, the type of stories or the type of environment they shoot. That inspires me more. A good photo won't, won't be a good photo just because it looks a certain way. It will be because it tells something that is memorable or that makes you feel something or reflect on something. It's not like the tool you have in your hand, it's like your eye, your heart, your brain, that's all. Mm -hmm.